What's up, guys? It's me, your badass host, Draven, and welcome to another episode of our Pokemon Crystal Walkthrough. Okay. So, I hope you guys enjoyed last episode. I mean, we did win another badge, our, what, 14th badge? Yes. But it was a special one. We beat Brock with a whole new set of team, you know. Uh, we had our Pokemon that we nicknamed, like, uh, Tank 2, Hydra 2, Sweet Boom, Lucky, Razor, those kinds of Pokemon we defeated Brock with. And, uh, well, now it is time to go to Mount Moon, travel to the, that place just a little bit, and, you know, finish off traveling Kanto right here, you know? That's basically what we're going to be doing right now, right? Yeah, we're going to be doing that. So, moving on forward right here, we can actually go to uh, Mount Moon, and I actually had to modify the time. And wait, there's a notice here. Mount Moon gift shop is now open. Okay. I actually had to modify the time right here in order for this event to actually work. Um, if you guys remember, there are Clefairy there that you can actually, well, you can actually find, um, or dancing Clefairies or whatnot, what and that's why we need the night. So we're gonna be battling a few people here and there, and you know, exploring a lot of places. Hmm. I don't know what to do. What do you know how to do? Alrighty, here we go. Little short shorts man Warren wants to battle me with his Fero. Alrighty, bring it on. Let's go. And, uh, well, let's go with that Thunderbolt attack. Oh, uh, yeah. Say bye bye. Okay, okay, and, uh, let's see. What? News, new news. No, there's no new news. He's like, I knew I'd lose. Dude, you shouldn't be battling if you knew you'd lose. Uh, let's see. Anything new around here? No, it's pretty much the same thing. You got to battle, well, not a lot of people. Not like the first time, and, uh, you know. Mount Moon's a little bit different. It's a little shorter than, than usual. And, uh, well, let's see. Let's go to Relic. I missed you, Relic. Missed you for a while. Let's go. Let's take this guy on. I can run like the wind! So can I, buddy. So can I. Let's do this. Youngster Jimmy wants the battle and he's coming out with his Raticate. Little do they know, I got myself my Relic back. Relic, do the Psychic Attack. And, uh, wow. Uh, you gotta love that one right there. But here we go, Psychic Attack for the win. Huh. Look at that, Raticate. Going down like a sack of potatoes. And, uh... Well, who's next? Who is next right here? You're coming out with an Arbok, so I'm gonna stay. I'm gonna stay put with my Relic right here, because Relic has got your, uh, your your Kryptonite right here. And uh, let's go with that Psychic Attack. Oh, yes. Bye bye Say bye-bye to Arbok. That was an easy victory right there, right? It was, it was. It was an easy victory. Youngster Jimmy is just blown away. That's right, you're blown away. I'll see you in a few. Uh, let's see, there's more trainers right here, right? No. Oh, there's one right here. We're gonna... Let's go ahead and switch this one off. Uh, let's go... Let's go with Toxic Batman. I got... I just realized something. While I was actually teaching my, uh, my other set of Pokemon new moves, I realized that, hey, you know, Giga Drain can actually be taught to my, uh, my uh, Toxic Batman. So I taught it Giga Drain. And, uh, wow, we're battling Fire-type Pokemon. We're not going to be able to use that one right there. Um, but it's got a new move. You know, a very good new move against Butthead right here. Alright, let's go. Fly attack. That fly attack does its thing. Alrighty, alrighty. Okay, alrighty. Wheezing, okay. Let's go to... Of course. Of course. Relic. Okay. Let's, uh... Let's do that psychic attack. Uh, let's see. What else do I have to talk about? I don't know. I'm beating everybody. We're close to being done with this game. Believe it or not, we are, we're almost done with this game, guys. And, uh... We're hoping to be done with this game by, what? The start of February? Holy crud. By the start of February, we're going to be done by this game. Wow. I'm, I'm so happy about this. And, of course, many of you guys already know, the next game in line for our walkthroughs is Pokemon Emerald. Yes. We're going to be exploring Hoenn like we never exploded before. 
Yes. I'm, I'm, I'm waiting for that. I'm always antsy for the new walkthroughs right here, too. Alrighty. There's that surf attack. Surf attack does its damage. Surf attack does it. That's right. Alrighty. Okay. And down goes that fire breeder. His name is Otis. He's like, it's sunny. It's not, it's not sunny at all, man. It's dark. Okay. Let's move on right here. Um, I'm mocking, I'm mocking, I'm doing my thing, strutting my thing right here. And, uh, we don't have another trainer here. Huh. Oh, wait, this guy. Okay, bring it on. Step right up and take a look. Okay. Let's see what you got, buddy. Let's see what you got. Fire, another fire beater, his name is Bert. And he's coming out with his coughing while I come out with Toxic Batman. Why? I don't know. Let's go with fly. I want to fly. Fly like an eagle. There's no way. Fly like an eagle. Eat that coffin. That's right. I do like it. How do you like it? He doesn't like it very much. And Cinder, of course, growing levels without doing anything. So here, he's coming out with a slugma. I'm going to go with Nessie. Go on with Nessie. Let's go, Nessie. Bring it on. Show this Slugma who's boss. And, uh, yeah, Slugma's another Pokemon that you can actually capture in the Kanto region, ironically. And uh, would you look at that. Say bye-bye, Slugma. Bye-bye. There we go. That's right. Fire Beer of the Birth. L -l -l -loss. He's like, yeah, that's hot. Alrighty. Okay. I'm moving on. And, uh, of course, there's no Pokemon Center here anymore. Uh, and like I said, the Mount Moon is, has been cut in half. It's really, yeah, it has been cut in half dramatically. It's just, it's, it's very annoying and stuff. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to switch up my Pokemon right here. And I'm going to go into Mount Moon right here. Now, before anything, wow, it's been a while since I've seen you, buddy. It's been a while, Draven. Since I lost to you, I thought about what I was uh, liking with my Pokemon. And we came up with, the, with an answer. Draven... Now we'll show you. Alrighty. Okay. Bring it on. Bring it on, motherfucker. So here we go. Another battle against Silver. He doesn't seem so pushy very much. And he's coming out with his Sneasel. Where in well did, did you find that Sneasel? I don't know. I don't care. Fire Punch. For the win. There we go. Say bye-bye to Sneasel. It's it it's it's the same thing over and over and over again. Come on, Silver, just figure it out. And uh, he's coming out with his Feraligatr. Okay, so he's desperate right now. So I'm gonna go with Kid Thunder. Oh yeah, Kid Thunder right here. Oh yeah, he's itching for a battle right now. Kid Thunder with a Thunder Punch or Thunderbolt, I should say. And, uh, well, for Alligator, say bye-bye. Bye-bye for Alligator. And, uh, would you look at that. Kid Thunder finally grows to level 53. That's good. Good stuff. And, uh, of course, Cinder growing levels like he usually does. And, uh, he's gonna be coming out with his Magneton. Who, oh, who did not get any, uh, loving right here? Let's go with Teddy. I wonder if Teddy can actually use that Earthquake attack on him. We shall see. Here we go. Earthquake attack. Oh yeah, it does work. Look at that. Oh yeah, Magneton's not... He wasn't prepared for this one right here. And, uh, of course, I'm just going levels. And, uh, let's see, he's got three more Pokemon. He must be very pissed off right now. So let's go to our boy Relic right here. Alrighty, Relic. See what you can do right now. That's a big mouth on a big gold bat. But Relic's got that psychic attack. This guy cannot throw out an attack right now. We are invincible. We will destroy you. We're actually embarrassing him right now. Whatever self-esteem he has, he has no more. And uh, Cinder just, you know, doing his thing right here. And he's going to be coming out with his Gengar. Who didn't get any battle right now? Any battle 11? Let's go with Nessie. Go with Nessie. Alrighty, okay. It's been a while since I've taken on a Gengar right here. Alright, Nessie. 
Do your thing. Dragon Breath. And wow. Did not know. Oh, well, yeah, I kind of lie. Gengar is faster than uh, Lapras right here. We gotta beat this guy quickly before the curse starts killing us. And, uh. Oh, wow. There we go. He finally, he finally landed a hit on us right here. And that curse attack is worse than a, than a toxic attack. And wow. Yeah, he's landing hits right now. Yeah, I, I, I gotta give him a, a nugget here and there, just just to make him feel satisfied and stuff. And uh, would you look at that, he's got one more Pokemon coming out with an Alakazam. I'm gonna go with Toxic Batman. That's right. It's a risk, I know, it's a risk I'm willing to take right here. Okay, Toxic Batman, do your thing. Fly. Fly like an eagle. Don't get hit. Yeah. Alright, here we go. Fly attack. Come on, for the win. For the win. For the win. For the win. Eat it. Eat all of it. And, uh, yeah. There we go. Silver's just defeated. He's like, I thought I raised my Pokemon to be the best they could be. But it still wasn't enough. <laughs> Alright. You won. Fair and square. I admit it, but this isn't the end. I'm going to be the greatest Pokemon trainer ever because these guys are behind me. Listen, Draven. One of these days, I'm going to prove how good I am by beating you. All right. Well, if you guys haven't noticed, he actually kind of changed his tone a little, which is kind of good. I mean, that's good. Uh, progress. That's what we needed, right? Progress. That's good. Now, if you if you guys play Pokemon Heart Gold and Soul Silver, you guys will see that. Yeah. There's a lot of progress. Now, if you go right here, at nighttime, you will be able to we'll see, uh, you, you guys will be able to see a special event right here. And uh, it's not happening right now. Holy crap, what the hell? What's going on? Okay, so there's supposed to be a time and a place, at uh, nighttime, where Clefairy walk out like this, like this, like this, and they see me like this, and then they run away like this. And they leave a little gift right here. That is the ra that is the reason why uh, Kid Thunder has a, you know, a Rock Smash because they leave a Rock Smash move right there. So I kind of feel dumb right now. I'm gonna go right here and uh, this little shop right here. Wow, where where is everybody? Okay, apparently they they're not here yet. Okay, so I feel very very dumb right now. All right, getting out and like that shortcut. We are in Route Four with a lot of people here. And uh, you know what? I'm going to show off Toxic Batman's Giga Drain. I have yet to do that yet. Alright. What's up? I have a feeling that I can win. Let's see if I'm right. Well, excuse me. Here we go. Picnic... Wow, I almost misread that. Picnic or Hope. If you take out the P, that would have been bad. Alright, here we go. Giga Drain. It's a pretty cool move. It really is. Look at that. Ah, uh, yes. Very, very cool move right there. And, uh, well, he's flappy. He's just gonna lower my speed right now. And, uh, let's go again with another Giga Drain. Look at that. Ooh, yes. Shiny. Pretty good move right there, huh? It's a very good move. Alrighty, okay. That's right. That's right. Victorious. Alright, Hope. He's like, oh, you're too strong. Yes, I am. Yes, I am. Diddly am. And, uh, is there a hidden item right here? There should be a hidden item right here. Let's see. I'm gonna use a, the, the, the item finder and whatnot. Let's see. Okay, there's a hidden item right here somewhere. Oh, God. Okay. I give up. All right, uh, let's go and uh, let's go ahead and uh, start beating up on some people right here. Let's go with Cinder. It's been a while, huh, Cinder? Let's go. I'm raising my Pokemon. Want to battle with me? Heck yes. Do you know how to Pokemon? You don't know how to Pokemon. Here we have Bird Keeper Hank, and he's coming out with his uh, Pidgey. Cinder. Alright, Cinder. Do your thing. Flame Wheel. Flame Wheel. Six. Wow! Okay, I just realized that Pidgey's at level 12. 
Wow. Uh, yeah, I feel very, very stupid right here. Wow. See, even 69 doesn't work? Okay, there we go. <laughs> Level 59. All right, Cinder. There we go. And he's going to come out with his Pidgeot. I'm going to go with Kid Thunder. Will Kid Thunder do the job? We will find out. All right. Let's go. Thunderbolt. But that's not enough. Quick attack. Alrighty. Look at that. Now, uh, my question is, how, is it Pid how does he have a level 34 Pidgeot? Don't they evolve at level 36? I'm just wondering. I'm asking for a friend here, you know? And, uh, that is it. Hank has been defeated. I lost. He lost. Alrighty. What's next? Okay, so we got this one lady right here. I swear to God, there's a hidden item right here somewhere. God, I want to find it. I want to find it. I want to find it. Come on, where are you? Where are you, you little slut? Not there. Okay. Uh, okay. We we can always face her, and she's like, mm, I. That's it, right? I'm um, I. Alrighty. Let's go. She's coming out with her fur right here. I'm trying to wonder. I'm like, I'm wondering, what does she mean by that? I really am. I'm, I'm wondering what the hell does that all mean. Okay, here we go. Flame wheel. There we go. Flame wheel. Flame wheel does it. Flame wheel does it. There we go. And, uh, okay. Alrighty. You got two Pokemon? Okay, Sharon. She's coming out with a Rapidash. Okay, okay. I'm liking what I'm seeing here. Let's go, Teddy. We're gonna go with Teddy. And look at his Rapidash. Just so majestic and stuff. It's flame, just flaming and all that stuff. It's a good Rapidash. Alrighty. Here we go. Earthquake attack. Is that Earthquake gonna work? It is gonna work. Look at that. Alrighty. How'd you like that? How do you like that? And that is the end of Sharon right there. And she's like, wow. Okay, she doesn't say stuff. Okay, what are you what are you gonna say? I'll go trade some more. Good. Good for you. Alright, here we go. We got one little item right here. And there's a hidden item out there that I'll eventually find. And uh, it's an HP up. Wow. Alright, let's let's see what we got in our bag of tricks right here and uh, okay so we got a potion right here that we don't really need and we're gonna give that to Nessie look at that 20 HP back then it would have been a lot and there is the HP up and uh, that's pretty much it and our repel has worn off okay alrighty so that's basically it right there guys uh, we're back at Cerulean City and uh, you know what we're gonna go back to Pewter City and uh, make our way make our way back down to Viridian City so let's go and do let's go ahead and do that right now so here we are back in Pewter City there, it doesn't take a long time to get back to Viridian City because they did take away the Viridian Forest I don't know why but I'm so glad that in Pokemon uh, Heart Gold and Soul Silver that you know they brought that back up right here and uh, we got ourselves another max potion that's good good for us let's go with our bike yeah this used to be this this is what is left of the Viridian Forest, guys. It's sad. It really is. And it's a Fruit Baron beer, and yeah, I don't want that. Okay. We're going to move on, and I know that there's a hidden item right here somewhere. Is there? Ah, there's one. And we grab that. The dire hit. Okay. Somebody needs to stop leaving all these dire hit shits. Alright, the speed has risen, and uh, dire hit. Hello! Okay, alrighty, and uh, we are out of the Viridian Forest, <laughs> and uh, into enemy territory right here. Why don't girls like bug Pokemon? Uh, because girls are girlers. They're girls. Come on. Alright, so here we go. We're taking on Bug Catcher Doug, and he's coming out with his Ariados. Alright. Bring it on, Doug. Let's go. Uh, Fire Punch! Fire Punch eliminates you like that. That's right. How do you like that? You don't like that very much. 
And, uh, I guess that's pretty much it, right? For that guy? Yeah, it's done. It's done deal. No good. Alright, what do you have to say, homeboy? Bug Pokemon squish, uh, Pokemon squish like plush toys. When you squeeze their bellies, I love how they feel. Okay, um, it's a good reason to have bug type Pokemon, buddy. It really is. Uh, it's just, they're not really that strong. Not that strong. And here we have another bug catcher, I believe. My bug Pokemon are tough. Prepare to lose. Okay, it doesn't really matter. Yeah, it really doesn't matter if they're strong or not. So here we go, another bug catcher. His name is Rob. And he will be coming out with his B drill. Alright, let's go. Let's do this. Talks about man. You know what to do. Fly attack. That's right. It's like the, it's like it can read my uh, my thoughts. There we go. Fly attack does the thing. Fly attack does the work. Look at that. That's right. Fly attack. And uh, is he coming out with another Pokemon? Oh yeah. He oh he has a Butterfree. Okay, so he's one of them competent uh, bug catchers. It actually evolves his Pokemon. Holy crud! I'm liking this. All right, here we go. Trying to sleep powder us? No, thank you. Alrighty. And uh, would you look at that? Defeated the Butterfree just like that. And, uh. Well, that's it. I was whipped. Yeah, you were. You were whipped. Uh, let's see. I'm going to look for stronger bug Pokemon. Good luck with that. Alright, what does this say? Route 2 Viridian City, Pewter City. Welcome to Viridian City, the gateway to the Indigo Plateau. Alrighty, so here we are in the, uh, oh, yeah, we are in Viridian City, and if you talk to this guy, hey kid, I just had a double shot of an espresso, and I am wired. I need to talk to someone, so you'll have to do. I might not look like much now, but I was an expert uh, catching Pokemon. Do you believe me? Yeah, pretty much. You taught me how to catch Pokemon. Good, good, yes, I was something out of uh, the ordinary. Let me tell you. Or I'll tell you. Okay, whatever. And, uh, well, of course, Viridian City has its gym. And its gym leader, of course. Uh, or let me talk to this guy right here. This gym didn't have a leader for until recently. A young man from Pallet became the gym leader, but he's away often. Okay. Yeah, that, that, that's, that's kind of weird because, look, if you guys remember... Yeah, it doesn't say anything right here, the name or anything like that. It, it likes to keep the mystique. But if you guys remember, in Pokemon Red, Blue, and Yellow, the gym leader was often away just because, uh, you know, he was doing his criminal thing. But since we stopped them, he closed down everything. And, of course, we all know who the gym leader is. We just need to find him now. And uh, he's not here. So we just, we're just going to be moving on right here now. If you go right here, talk to this person. Do you put a lot of uh, thought into naming your Pokemon? Kinda. Giving them good nicknames adds to the fun of trading them with others. Okay, that's good. And, uh, there's Speary the Spearow and uh, Reddy the Reddita. Oh, yeah? Oh, yeah? Those aren't good nicknames at all. I really... Yeah, they're not. Now, talk to this guy right here. He's like, I heard that there are many items on the ground in the Viridian Forest. There is. I got most of them. And, uh, well, let's see. Last point of interest is this place right here. This is the trainer house, club for top trainer battles. We're going to go in here and we're going to be battling a, a little somebody somebody right here. Um, it's pretty much the same person every freaking time. I'm going to start with Talks of Batman. Okay. So if you go right here, talk to this person. It's like, hi, welcome to the training hall. You may battle a person once per day. Cal is your opponent today. Would you like to battle? Heck yes. Go right through. Of course, Cal is the only Pokemon trainer that you will be able to battle, and he looks exactly like you. I traveled out here just to, so I could battle you. Alright. Let's go. Bring it on. Here we go. Guy that looks like me. Pokemon trainer Cal wants to battle, and he does have the three starter Pokemon from Johto. This is a new one right here. Look at that. Luckily for me, yeah, I have Toxic Batman. And, uh,. Well, every single time you battle them, it's always at level 50. Uh, it's good experience points, but unfortunately, it's only three Pokemon every freaking time. So, what's the deal with that? And, uh, wow. Stays alive right there. And here comes that Body Slam attack that we've been dreading. And, uh, oh god. Paralysis at its finest. 
Let's go with a fly attack and no, body slam again. Here we go, fly like an eagle. Synthesis, oh crud. Alrighty. All right, here we go, fly attack again, and will it do it? It does. Say goodbye to Mag Meganium. And uh, that's, uh, like I said, good experience points right there. And uh, he's gonna be coming out with his Typhlosion, so let's go with Nessie. All right, Nessie. Time to do your thing right here. I don't know how this guy got these three Pokemon, but I'm gonna find out with a Surf Attack. And, oh wow. Yeah, this Pokemon's faster than mine, so yeah, we gotta, we gotta, you gotta be worried about that. Here we go, Nessie for the Surf. And that Surf Attack does, does it hit it? Does it do it? Does it, oh come on, it does. That's right, it does it. And uh, of course, the experience points is the same every single time. And uh, for Alligator, okay. Bring it on with Kitunda. Alrighty. Let's go. Let's do this. Kid Thunder. Let's go. Kid Thunder Thunderbolt. Again, this is a very good place to train your Pokemon, but like I said before, it's once per day. Once per day, guys. That's all you get, which is ridiculous. And uh, I kind of feel like they needed to change this one up right here. And, uh, would you look at that? We beat him. He's like, I, I lost. Darn. Yeah, he lost. Oh, and thanks for the money, too. And, of course, he stays in there for the whole time being. Okay, so that's done right there. And, uh, I don't need to talk to anybody right here. Alright. Uh, so what we're gonna do right now, I... Yeah, we're gonna stop right here, guys. In our next adventure, we're gonna be going straight to Pallet Town all the way down to... Hmm... I want to say Cinnabar Island or what's left of Cinnabar Island. So stay tuned, guys. I'll be right back, or I'll see you guys in the next episode. See you guys.